Uh, so I'm Takeshi Uchi from the University of Tokyo, and uh, so our research is real-time simultaneous 3D reconstruction and optical flow estimation. So actually, uh, our research topic is monocular stereo. So we want to find the depth map from two images uh, by assuming the known camera poses. So from that camera pose, we can define the 2D search space. So, but the but the problem is uh, so when we have uh, there is a pose error. So of course there is a wrong search space. And uh, another problem is uh, uh, depth and the correspondence is uh, hardly uh, constrained. So then, <clears throat> so this is an example. So there is a disparity error caused by pose error. So when the pose error becomes large, so the error become, uh, disparity error becomes large. So then our solution is to relax the disparity estimation by decoupling depth x and the correspondence u. And uh, we need to minimize the separated uh, optical flow constraint and the 3D constraint. And this is the details of constraints. And uh, for the optical flow constraint, uh, we combine the TVL1 at, and the uh, flow net for large displacement. And for the 3D constraint, uh, of course, we need a reprojection error. And also, we uh, employed a minimal surface realizer for smoothing the surface. And uh, in the optimization speed, uh, step, uh, we need to minimize the error. So, but uh, still, uh, this uh, formula is uh, I, u and the x uh, hardly constrained. So then uh, we introduced the uh, uh, handler uh, uh, UPJ, and the uh, lambda is controlling uh, the uh, decoupling weight. And, uh, and, and in the optimization process, uh, we used uh, ADMM. And first, uh, we solved uh, U uh, by holding X and UPJ constant. And next, uh, UPJ is solved. And finally, uh, we got the X. And these steps are iterated. And uh, we implemented this on uh, GPUs. Uh, we, uh, this is a little bit high spec, but so we used uh, two GPUs. Uh, one is for format two, and one is uh, for our method. And uh, for image side, this Im image side, uh, we achieved the uh, uh, 10.8 frame per second. And I'll show the comparisons. Uh, so uh, we used the KT uh, 2712 and uh, com compared with the flow and the flow net two. And of course, the flow net two is a basic and uh, have a, a best performance, but uh, so our method uh, is outperforms the uh, deep flow. And uh, so this is uh, the depth estimation uh, result. And uh, our method outperforms the Graeber's method. And this is comparison and uh, the percentage of the erroneous pixels uh, uh, less than the previous method. And this, is, uh, this shows the uh, effect of the decoupling rate so when the pose error is large, uh, we need a more soft uh, decoupling rate. So if you are interested in our work, uh, please come by our poster. Thank you.